Keith, what's going on? Hey, you here? Hey, you here? Quick! I hadn't even hit the button yet. It say you uh you already there? Hey, type seven, man. If you can uh if you can hear me good. MK Markel, what's going on? Hey, good, good, good. Hey, just want to tell you uh if you you know by looking at the title of it, you know what uh today's my birthday. Let's see uh. I'm going to talk about a giveaway. Listen, this uh, video, this live is only going to be exactly one hour. You know what I mean? If I can make it last that long. Uh, Catmaster Catfishing. What's up, man? Hey, thank you. I hey, appreciate the, uh, the shout out on my on my birthday. And uh, like I say, this is just, uh, uh, I'm going to do my first fire. I know I'm late. Put this together already. Did a video. Haven't even put the video out. It's already edited. You know what I mean? It's just a couple of more things I wanted to like add to it. Uh, outside of that, Dominique's Kitchen. Hey, thank you, MK uh, Markel. Thank you, thank you, Canadian Mom. Hey, there she is, Canadian Mom. Uh, thank you. Listen, I didn't see your comments and from the live the other day until like uh, after it was all over with. I just like let, let it play in the background, and I saw you was in there. Uh, Jamie Stabler. Hey, of course you in there. Hey, Kirby. Hey, thank you. Hey, thank you, everybody. Hey, hey, Catmaster. Appreciate you putting that uh, fam on it, man, because that's what we are, man. This little tight-knit, you know, YouTube fam. All right, so I'm going to go over this again. Listen, we're going to talk about a giveaway. It's my birthday. We didn't got that out the way. Uh, I'm going to do my first fire right here on this uh, Rectech 680 grill. What I'm doing is just doing the bake, trying to get rid of the uh, the oils, all the hand prints and all that stuff. It's got a silicone. Uh, all the edges and uh, corners have been uh, with a high-tip silicone. You know, we're just going to season it. Well, it's not really a season. We're just going to bake it, get all the oils to bake off of it. And after that, then uh, tomorrow morning before I head to the racetrack, I'm going to go ahead and stick a uh, pork shoulder or a pork butt on here and get it all seasoned up and go from there. Armani B, hey, thank you, bro. Hey, listen, hey, I won't be eating good until uh, until Monday. That's crazy I say that. The toy Oh, my God, the tortilla channel. Hey, just on time. Thank you. Thank you for the happy birthday uh, shout out. I appreciate that. Let's see, was that Sean? Who was that? All right. Uh, all right, chat. Then we got uh, Sharon Monroe. Uh, hey, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Uh, hey, in for the grill. Hey, you ain't got to say that, A.B. All you got to do is hit boom. I know who that is. Let me get my red cup. Thank you. My, my uh, lovely assistant. And I uh, got my drink. And then we're going to get started. Huh? You don't taste nothing in there? Really? Did you? Hold on, y'all. She said she put a little birthday kick up right here. You ain't putting nothing in there. I didn't put nothing in. Oh, no, no. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, man. It's birthday cake. Really? Hey. Hey, look what she did. Hey, look what she put. I wonder, can you guys see that? See a little birthday cake right there? Hey, well, look. Look how much is left. I got it. Mrs. Garcia. Hey, thank you. Means a lot, Ms. Garcia. Look at this a little bit. You know I got to drive my car, right? Mix it up. Yeah. <laughs> Jamie said, oh, Lord. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. There's a reason why I don't drink, folks. All right. So, bear with me. First thing we're gonna do is just get this knocked out so I can get my hour little burn on this. So what I'm gonna do right now is uh, add some of these pellets. Hey, thank you, uh, Scott. Appreciate that, bro. That's one of the things I wanted to talk about also. It's like, you know what, trying to transform my uh, patio into like an outdoor kitchen. You know what I mean? I got I already have a cooktop. You know what I mean? I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do it out here. So I don't have to be in the kitchen, you know? This California, baby. We can uh, do whatever we want to do. We only get 28 days of rain. Bear with me. I'm probably going to have pellets all over the...
Well, we had our first little mishap. You gotta love live, uh, live TV, huh? And this was uh, Rectex formula here. This is the ultimate blend. It's a premium hardwood. And just to show you guys what they look like, this is what they are. I don't know. Let's see if I go like this. Maybe it'll focus. Hey, what's up, Snoopy Eats? What's going on with you? You loving? <laughs> you saying you loving life right now? Hey, it's, it's good times right now, man. Good times. I get all this cleaned off later. All right. Now, I've already took out, look, the deflector plate. I did this right before we started. Is that what you're about to do, uh, Scott? A reverse here, huh? So listen, after reading, uh, let me stop lying. I did read it one time. You know, they talked about a, a line in this drip plate, you know, with aluminum. I did read that. That's actually in the instructions for Rec Tech. But one thing that I did was uh, watch several videos, and they all say if you want to have a, uh, a good cleaning, you know what I mean, uh, it's best to line this drip plate, which I'll show you in one second. Second, you know. I'm gonna do something right all the way. Now I'm not the best at wrapping presents or nothing like that. But one more, and then I'll be able to show you guys just one second. If you know me, you know cleanup ain't my, my expertise, so maybe if I don't get it so dirty. Okay, so here, this is what I did. I just lined this this way. They said to fold this edge. You know what I mean? Uh, get it over. It's not the best. But anyway, this right here, which I probably didn't need to do right now, because I'm not even uh, getting ready to uh, cook. This is just the initial burn. Let's turn it this way. And it's ready to go back in. Oh, one more thing. Since it's brand new. Look. Alright, there we go. They said take a handful of pellets, which are right here. Try not to drop them so you guys can see them. Take a handful of pellets and put them in this cup. Did that. Put this detector plate back. And then listen, if you get one of these, this is important. You see this cutout? It's got a, a shallow one right here. 
Night and day difference. Small, boom. The, this one right here, the large cutout, goes towards the back. This is the, like the, uh, the part of the grill that has the uh, auger in the inside. And to be honest with you, the way they made this, you, there is no wrong way to put it together. It's almost like building a computer. What we got? Let's see what we made. Hey, B, you know that? Hey, why you say I turned 30, homie? Yeah, I'm 28, man. Don't put no, no numbers on me, no age on me. No, Mr. Uh, Canadian Grill. I've been talking about this grill for the last couple of years. It finally got down to my price range. Hey, I want to tell you guys, too, if you get this grill, they stressed a lot about being careful because of the uh, temperature probe, which is right here. You guys might not be able to see that right as of this second, but I'm going to get it in here for y'all. I'm not going to really worry about the grates right now. We're just going to get it uh, cracking. So, man, I don't like nothing dirty. So listen, we're gonna get the power. I want to get it up to 400. Right now it says it's 88 degrees in the inside already. Got that going. Button for the light, light work. And uh, we're gonna close it and get it started. What I'm gonna have to do today is uh, go buy myself some type of uh, little small trash can, like an aluminum uh, can. Like those of you that have horses, stuff like that, you know what I mean. What's that, Charlie's uh, Smoking Barbecue? Hey, thank you. Hey, same here, man. Glad you can uh, make this stream. And uh, hey, I just want to say thank you. Hey, it's, it's been major that, you know, people that I probably that I wouldn't have never, ever met, you know what I mean, reach out to you, say uh, happy birthday to you. You know, when they see you go live, you know, they support your channel. I think that right there is just amazing. Hey, so I'm saying thank you to everybody. All right, so we got this going. This is going, we'll let that uh, continue. And what else are we gonna talk about? Ah, we might as well go ahead and get this, uh, let's get this giveaway away, you know, out the way right now. So look, I'm gonna move you guys, hold on. Let's do like this. Uh, what did you say? I didn't uh, see it. Let me go back. I'm going back. Let me see. I'm looking for the uh, question right now. Oh, you asked me how big is the smoker? Uh, this right here, this is the Rectec 680. I don't know. I'm going to say, let, let, let's guesstimate a little bit. Probably. Hey, you know what? I can't go. Hey, you asked me a question that I should know. You know what I mean? Uh, oh shit! I can smell it now. This on its way rising right now. It's at 89 degrees. Man, I can smell them pellets starting to starting to heat up. Uh, as far as the size go, hey, I tell you what. Look, these grates. If you can see. You can just see about about the size and the depth. It's probably like about, I don't know, a little under two feet, you know, as far as uh, the depth goes. And then you got, you got two of them. Just so you can see. So you got a pretty decent size uh, cook surface. I just don't, I could go get my uh, tape measure, but you know, I just don't want to leave the Stream. Hey, but you know, uh, I did do a video and I'll put all the specs and how I built it so everybody can see it. 
Everyday Barbecue. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Everyday Barbecue. Hey, you know what? Man, should I be showing you this? You know what I mean? I know you want to blast me. You get out and do your, you get out and do your thing. Okay. So we rise in here. We got that going. I'm going to turn this over here on this. Hey, thank you. Let's do it like this. Get it to focus on that. Thank you, Jamie. We're going to talk about this little smoker here. And I'm going to listen. I'm going to give it away. It's brand new. This is by Masterbuilt. Everything is in the inside. Just the way, like when I received it. It's a propane smoker. You know what I mean? Obviously, you don't need it. Especially with this behemoth right here. Uh, you know, it's just a portable gas smoker. Everything is, you know, with it, everything minus a, uh, a propane tank. Now listen, I never did use it because, you know, with me working on uh, that side of the country, and then I had leased an apartment, I wasn't quite able to just start smoking. So, this is what I want to do. I want to give this away to some lucky uh, subscriber. Yeah. Give it away to some lucky subscriber. Uh, and, and I know this might sound wild. Hey, chilling. In, hey, what up, Rob D? Man, I love that name, man. Chilling and grilling. Hey, so look, I want to give it away to somebody here in the United States. So I'm asking only the people in the United States, you know, participate or whatever. Uh, I'll pay for the shipping. I know it's big or whatever. But I want it to go to some to somebody that's gonna put it to use, and hopefully you can uh, make a video and just show everybody, you know, what you did, whatever you created. So this is how we gonna enter this. Listen, I have a Facebook page, and we're gonna do it like this. I got a Facebook page, and let me just take the name of this. Uh, hey, it's no secret. Listen, the name of my Facebook page is Smoking and Grilling with AB. It's on Facebook. I'm after the end, at the end of this thread, at the end of this live, what I'm gonna do is uh, put a start a thread. You'll see this smoker. It'll say giveaway, blah, blah, blah. Uh, if you watch this, we'll just say, uh, hey, just type in there, hey, enter me. That's enter me and inside that thread. And then we'll give it, uh, let's just say this. We'll give it until the end of the month. And then uh, I'll do a random picker, a random comment picker. I'll do that live. Everybody can see it. You know what I mean? We'll pick somebody or the picker will pick someone and then uh, I'll get it off to them. Let's just do it like that. So I'm gonna put all of the particulars and everything in the description box below once this live is over with. But for you guys that's in here listening to it right now, we're gonna go to Facebook, you're gonna look up Smoking and Grilling with AB. You know what I mean? You're gonna look for this thread, I'm gonna pin this at the top. It's gonna run all month, you know what I mean? And uh, go ahead and just say, enter me, and then we go from there. All right, look, hey, we moving right along. Woo! Just gonna let it do its thing. So, let me do this now. How big is it smelling, maybe? Hey, how's it? Hey. Hey, well, I got to invent something so you guys can, uh, man, so we can all smell it. What do you say? Uh, oh, you talking about the dub? That means something different out this way. You know what I mean? But for me, it was, you know, nasty. That's right. Hey, new level audio. Check it out. We ain't got no food. Only thing I got is a drink. Just got some birth, birthday, uh, birth. Birthday cake, vodka, I don't know. She had made a drink once before. You know what I mean? That was cool, but I don't need no drink. I'm a, okay. All right. I just got an alert. Somebody just liked the Facebook page. Hey, thank you. And don't forget, at the end of this, I'm going to put a thread up. You'll see the uh, smoker in there. And then everybody just get in. You know what I mean? And uh, hey, good luck to y'all. All right, since we're moving so fast. Since we moving so fast, I'm thinking about this right here. Let's start talking about uh oh you know what? Hey, look, look at what Snoop say. Hey, that's right. Hey Snoop, hey, thanks for reminding me. 
Hey, listen, well, hey, she spruced this up. Does this count, or do I got to go with a, hard, a cold, hard shot? Talk to me. I owe that to you, man. It's going to go out to you and everybody else. Hey, good looking out, Kirby. Shot, homie. All right, hold on. Let me let me let me dial up a shot real quick. Baby, you down the other shot. Soon when we take a shot live, but you know, I said I will. Yeah, that's all. Bring. We're just we just gonna do it. All right, shot coming. Hey, she say, oh lord. Hey, one shot ain't gonna do nothing. Y'all watch me do that. Uh. Hey, that, that's big. Uh, everyday barbecue. That's real big of you. Hey, everybody, see what he uh what he said. He said if he win, please find a veteran uh to end it to. to well, you mean to send it to? I got it. It says he'll pay for the shipping. Hey, hey, no problem. Hey, me being a veteran, you know myself. Hey, I feel exactly. Hey, listen, I just want to give back. You know what I mean? Uh, I know we talk about everything. Everybody think when I say, hey, I'm on YouTube making videos. Everybody goes and says stuff like, uh, hey, you making money? Uh, hey, you, or they ask me, am I doing it for the money? I don't do it for that. I do it because I, I like the whole cooking, the electronics part about it. I just like it. You know what I mean? I love bells and whistles, and I just, I just love it. So listen, when that day comes and they do bless me to ever make any dime into it, you know what it does? It goes back right back into the channel. You know what I mean? So that I can just keep on creating and cre creating and creating. Hey. Hey, that's real talk right there, uh, Rob Dean. Every day is your birthday. You're right. Hey, no problem, uh, Snoop. She'll be able to see in just one second. She pouring. It was just like a little bit left. Hopefully, I got enough to even make a shot. Jamie, where you at? You better get yours together. Hey, Rob D, I'm not, I'm not cooking nothing today. Uh, D, you guys, I got, listen, I know I raced last weekend. Woo! Hey. I don't even know. Are we supposed to be doing this on YouTube? I mean, I guess we did in that thing. He said, I got a Pepsi. I'm at work. Is it that late already? One o'clock? Yeah, okay. Well, check it out. You know what? This goes out to everybody out here. Oh, man. Hey, uh-oh. Hey, Michael O.V. Hey, what's going on, buddy? Hey, it's been a while since uh, i seen you. Hey, we're glad to see you. Tell your pops we said hello. And uh, we, we go from there. All right, uh, hey, Snoop, I'm going to wait. We got Michael Lovie in here. You know what I mean? Uh, hey, he's a youngster. You know what I mean? Hey, just just hold up for a sec, Snoop. And uh, we'll do it. I got it, though, with me. <laughs> hey, I don't know what it is. Hey, but I just want to uh, respect. Hey, what's up, Ray Mack? Hey, thank you, man. Hey, to everybody in here, you know what I mean? We, I just want to show some respect to Michael Lovie. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm no drinker. You know what I mean? I just want to be responsible. I don't want him to see nothing, no bad habits. You know what I mean? I love when he come to the page. I'm trying to game with him and do all of that. You know? And, uh, hey, you guys understand? Hey, Michael, no problem, buddy. Hey, good to see you. I'll catch up with you Monday night. You'll see me in your videos, and I got a couple of videos I need to catch up with. All right, Michael, don't forget to tell your pop we said hello. Whoa, what's that, y'all? Woo! Hey. All right, see you later, Mike. What's that right there? Can y'all see that? Let's see here. Let's get it over there. Hey, you know what? Which is uh, crazy because I can't really uh, do too much. Because uh, I know I raced last weekend. That's what I was saying. I'm racing again tomorrow, but at my local track. There's some 50th anniversary thing. And uh, the race is tomorrow, which would really be no big deal. But they asking all of the racers to bring and drop off their cars, set up their camping area or whatever, you know, tonight. So that's what I'm going to be doing. That's why this uh, thread is only going to go for one hour. Right now, we 25 minutes and 16 seconds in. Once I get to one hour, we're going to wrap this up and we gone. I just wanted to stay true to, you know, keeping up with my Saturday Night Live. Excuse me, about Saturday Live. All right, Mike, go. All right, you. Hey, this goes out to everybody. Hey, check it out. Let's see what kind of... Oh, ferry. This is... Uh, I think I took the ferry when I was over there 
a year ago. I buy shot glasses wherever I go. But uh, where did I take the ferry to? I think to uh, Atlantic City. You know, took it over that way. Hey, you say quarter horse? No, quarter mile car. Hey, wait till y'all see it though. I got, hey, I got some things for y'all that's related to my channel and it's tied into my race car, man. It's gonna be hot. All right, hey, Snoop, you ready? Go ahead and hit that seven, man, when you're ready for me to do this. Hey, Kirby, I know you want to hold up a Coors Light. You know what I'm saying? Cheers. Cheers, everybody. Hey, that was, uh, hey, Ray Mac, that was some kind of birthday cake, birthday cake vodka. Woo! Hey, right now, I can tell you right now, it's working around here right now. <clears throat> Let me go ahead and get this right here. Got that, got that black cherry and grape Kool-Aid mix. Mmm. Oh, yeah. All right, now that I took my birthday shot, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Hey, let me go ahead and say this one more time. I'm good. Can you see it in my eye? Y'all can't say that was no water. That right there. I'm glad we wasn't drinking that that night. Hey. All right, we had 227. Oh, yeah. And it's going right now. Good in the hood, that's right. Hey, he say don't fall asleep. Like Snoopy sleeps. No, we ain't gonna do that. So listen, we covered, we got this going. This gotta cook for an hour. Now I'm gonna shut it down. I will tell you this though. I'm gonna tell you why I got I got a uh, pellet grill. Just for the fact that it it eases up my uh my cooking, takes a lot of stress out of the uh out of your cook. But here's where I'm gonna really test it. How many people can say you can put the brisket on here or some uh, uh, some pork, put it on here and then leave your house. How hard is that? You know what I mean? But this right here regulates itself. You know what I mean? As long as that hopper is full, which by the way, I got to say this, 40 pounds in the hopper, 40 pounds. Now, I don't know how long that's going to last, but uh, tomorrow I'm going to start timing it and just seeing how, but I'm sure it's a lot of different variables. You know what I mean? Depends on how hot the cookie is. You know what I mean? Uh, what you're cooking and stuff like that. Uh, Tri-tip will be, hey, that's on my list. So when I go to the store this evening, if I see a tri-tip, I get it, and I'll let you be the first to know, man. You don't understand the pellet thing? Uh, let me explain it to you like this. All right. Nah, I ain't got no, hey, it seemed that way, bro. Hey, but I, I gotta say this. Hey, a lot of hard work, a lot of sacrifice. You know what I'm saying? Uh, being away from the family. You know what I mean? Trying to raise kids. You know, being on the road. It's uh, it's tricky. It, it was it was a trade off. You know, I know you about to chime in, Kirby. I can hear you now. Hey, but uh, that hey, it just is what it is. You know, just hard work, and it just, it looked like I'm playing hard right now, which I am, cause uh, I ain't been home in a long time. You know what I mean? Usually I'm home five, six days, every 28 days, and I'm back out on the road. But uh, this time, I planned it just right. Hey, thank you, uh, Ray Mack. Hey, I planned this one right. I'm not trying to go back to work until uh, July 1st. <clears throat> All right, so, Jamie, we're going to go over this real quick. These are pellets. Let's see, put it on this. Does it focus on that, or is it too close, or whatever? Still trying to focus on me, I think. All right, look, that's a pellet. So listen, this is nothing but like, uh, for lack of a better term, let's just go ahead and call this like sawdust. You hear everybody talking about smoking and using like a fruit wood or whatever, like they might have uh, cherry wood, uh, uh, apple wood and all that. That's all these are, they just in pellets. So, I mean, that that's just the gist of it, real easy. You fill up a hopper. Ooh, pardon me. <laughs> Woo! Hey, man, I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good, folks. 
Okay. Fill up the hopper. Set the controls. It's almost like using the oven. Set the controls. That's just what is used 350 degrees. Set those. It's a heating probe in the inside. You got a circuit board right here that keeps it all. That's where the electronics come in. That's what keeps it where it uh you say 350 is gonna keep it at 350. Then Shot gone, man. Hey, I'm done. Hey, if it wasn't for the fact that I only got one of these, I might just take it and just throw it on the ground. So look, we got our degrees. We're not worried about our heat. And again, I just use 350 just for the heck of it. The pellets. And then I can hit this button over here on the side for smoke and just make it extremely smoky. So when you see those briskets and all that, when you hear us talk about bark, that's all the smoke, all the carcinic, carcinogens and all of that. It's on the outside of it. I'll be having questions about that. I'm like, hey, is that good for us eating all of that? Curry's two in the afternoon. No, nah, no fire. It's almost, hey, yeah, you. Uh, early when I had that thing, yeah, no fire. Remember when I was talking about that uh, that deflection plate? That deflection plate is what keeps the heat there, and then it comes up over the side right here. Hey, look, less chance of burning your food. You know what I mean? Things of that nature. We're coming up on 338. All right. Hey, you there with Chris? I'm trying to figure out what Chris is going to say. I know you got to hear that every night. He's talking about that, uh, that Gorilla Grill, that silverback he got. All right. I will tell you this though, if, hey, I think everybody should have a pellet grill. You know what I mean? Uh, it just, if you ever burned up any food or anything like that, then we're not even getting to the getting into that part about, man, the smokiness that it puts in there. You know what I mean? I just haven't put on and turned it where to start burning up all the pellets. It'd be so smoky out here, you know what I mean? It'd be hard for me to even be standing right here. But like I say, this is just the initial burn. You know what I mean? And, uh, the initial burn I means we just want to get all of the greases and everything from all the people that's assembled it and did whatever they did and the shipping, all the fingerprints and all that. You burn that off. You set that uh, silicone, uh, high temp silicone. You set that. After one hour, it's ready. You say you got a pellet gun. Hey, I used to do that, man. I used to do it. So, what else did I put in there? What was we going to talk about? We talked about the giveaway. I'm going to go ahead and just recap on this giveaway right here. We want to give away. Excuse me, I want to give away this master built uh, portable smoker. Hey, this is cool. Like if you're doing something at a park or something, you're bringing a, like a small little bud or something. You want to do that. You're hanging out with your kids, your family, or got a little function. You can smoke. I can promise you to be a uh, it'll be a conversation piece. You know what I mean? So listen, they enter the drawing. Hey, Jitter Flicks. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Man, I'm getting a double whammy. Double whammy. I'm going to show this again. Giving this away. Got to go to my Facebook. Smoking and grilling with AB. Go there at the end of this thread. I'm gonna immediately post a picture of this. It's gonna say giveaway. All you gotta do is say enter me inside of that thread. I'm gonna pin it at the top. At the end of this month, I'm gonna do a random picker, and then we gonna pick who I'm gonna ship this out to. You know what I mean? And uh, if I if I had anything to request, whoever wins, I want them to uh, hey make something, show it. If you don't, if you're not a creator, you know what I mean. Uh, hashtag enter me. Hey, man, y'all killing the game with the hashtags. Hey, you know what? Say that. Hashtag enter me. I'm going to hit it on uh, Instagram too. You know what I mean? And use that hashtag. Hey, thanks. All right, uh, so we, we talked about the, uh, the giveaway. You guys just see me uh, fire this up for the first time. We had 356. Uh, got pellets in that. We did the giveaway. What else? We oh everybody already said happy birthday to me, and uh, hashtag cook mentality is my baby on Instagram. What do you mean that's your baby? Who is that? Mrs. Kirby. That's right. Hashtag enter me. But cook mentality. That's uh, hey, that's right. That's Kirby's hashtag. Hey, you explain it, bro. That's right, Rob D. Hey, thank you. Hey, listen, I. 
I didn't want to put it up early and then have other people get into it. I wanted you guys to, uh, hey, thank you. Hey, I appreciate that. Hey, hit you with the double like you did me. Double thumbs up. I did, you know, I was trying to figure out how that would uh, come into play. But if you guys can remember, as soon as this is over with, and right now we have 35 minutes, just say we have 36 minutes right now. So we got 24 minutes left. And after that, we're done. I'm going to check this off at one hour. I'm going to go off and get my birthday uh, day started. And, uh, that's right. Hey, hey, Ray Mac. Hey, now that you in here, check it out. We were talking about doing a couple of things, man, for that theme food extravaganza. Hey, and here we go. Hey, we gonna use. Hey, I love that number seven. Let's do it like this. Let me fix this so I can I can quit looking and bending down. Well, you know what? Let's see if we can get it on the grill. Get this over here. I'll move. All right. Hey, enjoy your meal. Happy lunch brunch jitter flicks hey we all family hey thank you for stopping by hey tell everybody we say hello all right oh jitter oh dinner oh snap dinner Woo. trina what's your name for my for my 21st birthday that's right Hey, look, I, I said, let me fix this. Now I forgot what I was saying. Okay. Hey, well, you know what? Thank you. Hey, in the name of AB, smoking and grilling with AB, enjoy your meal. Okay. What is that, Philly feet? Hey, it's nothing. Uh, not cooking today, but from here on out, we're gonna do it. Oh, all right, Ray Mac, I'm gonna come back to it. But let me let me explain this. Look, we just fired this up for the first time. This is a, is its initial break in. That's all. So, uh, hey, everybody, tell Jitter Flix, hey, have a good meal, and uh, thank you for stopping by. This is just a burn, just to get it going. We finna get down now. Uh, probably about. 70 or 80 percent of my videos now i'm finna catch up with this uh barbecue you know you got that i don't know if you can see this let me move it over here i'm coming back to you ray this is my anniversary edition uh kettle grill too bad loud in here so i can get my hard time because i wanted to get the 26 inch he tell me no i get the 22 inch and everything that come out of his mouth is hey my 26 inch all right so let me go back over here All right, so now, man, this is tough, man. Since I've been home, I ain't been able to get my views right. You know what I mean? Uh, but I'm working with it. All right, so look, the theme food extravaganza. This is what came up today, Ray Mac. Kirby was cooking breakfast this morning live. So he was uh, trying to make pancakes. Let me rephrase that. He was making pancakes and waffles. I'm thinking... Hey, the Backyard Barbecue Show. Hey, uh, 26, I was gonna buy the 26, man, but it, I, let, I let Lyle talk me out of it. You know what I mean? Hey, but it's all good. I'm gonna add something else to it, whatever I can get. I'm gonna do a custom uh, paint, put a mural on it of, uh, of my little logo. I'm gonna do something. I just ain't figured it yet, out yet. I was thinking about getting the griddle. Okay. And I will say this, the 22 is a, uh, a good size though. Okay, look, so check this out, Ray. I was thinking about, and anybody, you guys can all chime in. I was thinking about doing some type of waffle-themed uh, extravaganza. You know, what you guys think about that? So that means if you want to do chicken and waffles, you want to do a waffle breakfast, or you want to go off the chart and do something crazy, y'all let me know. Tell me what you think. We toyed around with that. We talked about doing some type of uh, burrito. Hey, Snoop, you like that though, huh? Hey, I got to say this, Snoop. Your channel, hey, homie, that's awesome, man. Yeah, a crazy, hey, whatever. Let's just make it based around the waffles. Yeah, you got it. You got it. Hey, Ray, talk to me, man. I ain't heard you chime in on that. You thinking? You out here like... I'm saying we can go, go on the record now. I have put, let's do it every fourth... Uh, every fourth Friday of the month. 
But if you guys want to do it a little bit, waffle team, huh? Backyard barbecue, what you think about that? You need some information on it? What we doing? We just did a uh what did we do? We just did a hot dog. Oh, wait a minute, excuse me, it's called it was called a theme hot dog extravaganza. Ah uh, yeah, hey, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, so there it is. We hey, we locked in, folks. We locked in. I'm gonna get something up tonight. Don't know how I'm gonna do it. You know what I mean? I got a lot going on with between the night and something else. Hey, hey, let me just say this. Hey, Rob D. Hey, once we put it out there. Okay, the backyard barbecue show. Check it out. Look, keep your ideas to yourself. You know what I mean? Hey, you don't want to inspire nobody or get nobody else, you know, give nobody else no ideas, you know what I mean? So we can all just, where I come from, we say we're going to bust your eye out. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, it's just something fun. You know what I mean? We just get together, laugh, talk about, ah, I didn't even think about that. Dude made the same thing. Hey, look at his spin on it. And, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. There it is. It's written in stone, folks. What's my favorite uh, marinade? That's a good, man, that's a good question. Being honest with you, I just got hooked up with a company that just reached out to, uh, to me through Lyle from no, Lyle, uh, no Hippie Barbecue. He just referred somebody over there to me about a marinade. I'm getting ready to try theirs. When I do, uh, I ain't gonna lie to you, I'm not a big marinade guy, uh, but some of my best chickens and uh, meats that I've had from uh, other uh, people that, that are cute, they marinated their meat. And I just don't have a favorite, but I will say this though, my local uh, grocery store called Stater Brothers, they make a, a teriyaki uh, marinade. Usually whenever I see it, I just grab it. That right there is hot. I actually did a video. Hey, here's something funny. Colorful Camille gets in, right? She not even eating, not even 10 feet away from me. She just now getting in, huh? Yeah, okay. Then you're going to get in and try to steal all my thunder, huh? Okay. Hey, so be on the lookout. I'm going to try these uh, marinades and just see. I'm looking for something that's just out of sight. I can't do it, Rob D. Hey, she put a little bit in this too. I'm about to just give up. I'm about to pour some out for my homies on this grass and call it a day. I'm good. Shit, I done broke out a little. I don't know if y'all can see it. I got a little sweat. Let's check this out. Uh, all right, Jamie. Okay, look, by this being the initial burn, I'm looking at everything. Look, it stopped. Right now it's at 405. It's, I set it for 400 degrees, but uh, it's at 405. Now it's working its way down to 404. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? You can't, hey, listen, for those of you who know, like if you're doing competition meets, Especially when you, uh, uh, well, that would be the special, the special part about it. But when you cooking, you making these videos. As of right now, man, that's the way it look, man. I cannot. Somebody has taken some of my personal belongings, bro, and buried them on the East Coast. It's like the East Coast only, only look like they're the only ones that are. Uh, all right, look like they're the only ones that want me. I just can't find no work down uh, down here in Cali. But I will say this though, man, I ain't uh I ain't really been looking, but come Monday, I done had my fun. I've been home about three weeks now. Yeah, you're right, uh, Rob D. Calling me. Hey, now that I've been home these three weeks, I done got all my my racing and all that after uh, tomorrow. And uh you know what I'm saying, I'm finna start looking for me a job down this way. Come back to Richmond, huh? Richmond, oh man, I like Richmond too, man. Richmond is off the hook. Okay, look, now we down to uh, 400 degrees. So look, what I was saying was, 
you can't beat that. If you filming or something like that and you're trying to smoke a meat, you trying to get your uh, smoke ring right, you trying to get all of that right, you trying to, hey, listen, when you do competitions, the most important thing is temperature control. When you see those people at these uh, shows, when you watch them on TV, that's all it is, man. You say 2020 ain't being hard. Hey, man. Hey, I can put you on. I got my cousin. Hey, he rocking and rolling, homie. Hey, he just bought him a low ride. I'm like, that's what you want to do with your money? But you know, hey, he just, hey, he doing this thing. I got something to show you, though, Snoop. So, look, what I'm saying is if you guys are getting into any type of a competition or you want to woe somebody, temperature control is what it really is about. Uh, a lot of people don't tell you that, but if you can't control your, your temperature, you're in trouble. That's why a lot of people, hey, look. <laughs> that's why a lot of people, they shun when you say pellet grill. They say, ah, that's too easy. And my joke is, I can get my grandma out here. I could just weigh the meat and tell her, hey, put that on granny for about 12 hours at 195. In six hours, give me a temp. Look, I could tell her that on the telephone. So if I want, hey, anybody want to, hey, you get, you get one of these, you can call me in the middle of the night and show me a picture and tell me your weight and I'll tell you what you're going to do. You know what I mean? Then when you get through, you too be looking like you're in one of them $50,000 or $100,000 uh, competitions. And we finna make it happen right here. Ah, oh, Rob D. Hey, you start off high. Hey, but you know, everybody got their style. Everybody got their thing. I don't. I get, hey, listen. This here, I can tell you because I ain't got no secret. I'm making videos. You know what I mean? Hey, we start off. It depends on the size. I like 195 to 205. You know what I mean? At least five to six hours. It depends on how big the brisket is. You know what I mean? Then I work with it from there. You know what I mean? Then after that, talk to me about your rap. You know what I mean? Uh, how you rapping? You want to see the ribs on this? I mean, all right. No, hey, no problem. Just let me get through this season tomorrow because I'm going to put these on low and slow. Low and slow tomorrow. Hey, so while I'm racing and doing my thing, I'm going to call. You know what I'm saying? When I come home, we just look at this. You know what I mean? And uh, then we come off. After that, sky's the limit. Tri-tip. Uh, I got a brisket with my name on it. I got a brisket with your name on it, uh, Kirby. Did it come back? Better invite. Hey, no, no worries, no worries. Hey, look, let's see. We had 48. We got 11 minutes and 20 seconds left. So, last part I want to talk about, and I'm gonna take it off of this tripod so you guys can see. This is my little area that I got to work with. Let me do it like this. All right, this is my little area. I'm gonna change the camera. Hold on. Hey, meathead, what's going on with you? Hey, and while I'm out today, I got to get the right, uh, hey, give me that recommendation for that cowboy steak. You told me the, co the codes to get. Uh, you, you had said something. Let me know what it is right now, me that. All right, while I'm waiting on that. Okay, look, I want to show you. Look, I got to keep it separated because I got two Roddy's. I got, there's my boy he over there trying to duck the sun. I'm on this side because they finally came out and uh, I was gone last time he came out gardening to cut the grass. Then I had a tree removed. Bosco, what you doing? All right, so I need to trim this tree, but I'm getting ready to enclose this enclosure right here. I'm going to get rid of that bar. I got to keep my dogs. I got a girl. She's on the other side. She's the aggressive one. I'll keep her on that side on the, uh, you know, that's where the master bedroom is on that side. Uh, but this is my patio. So what I want to do is I want to, you know, I mean, I'm taking ideas. I just started right here and I got to fix all of this, but I'm in the process of doing this now. There's uh, getting my outdoor kitchen. I'm getting ready to get rid of this uh, picnic table. I'm sure Color with Camille, she hearing it now because she likes this picnic table. But I'm getting ready to put something right here. You know what I mean? And uh, we go from there. 
uh, I got all kind of stuff to do. You know what I mean? Uh, this 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 little this was a tall look. I forgot to show you that. Look, portable small one. What do you say? Oh, watch my. Hey, I will. I get. You know what? I'll do that. I want to do that. I got time now. After tomorrow, I'm I'm pretty much free. Hey, Ray Mac, come get it, man. Come get it. Hey, come get it. Come get it. Hey, here you go. <laughs> there it is. It's got your name written on it. You know what I mean? So I'm finna build something. Uh, I love to do little outdoor projects. So I'm gonna do something like a, a outdoor cabinet. I found something today while I was driving, uh, going to pick my car up, and uh, figure that out. What I'm gonna build? I'm gonna do an outdoor cabinet so I can. I got some uh, some spices, some stuff that I make myself. Uh, I make and sell my own rub also. So I'm getting into it. Hey, you like that, huh? Look, this is the initial burn. You know what I mean? Uh, it's going. Woo! Well, I can smell it. You can see right there. Look, I like that as far as, because uh, when you think about smoke, you know, that means long cooking. So if you're cooking overnight, you can come, hit this switch right here. You can hit that switch. And that turns the light on. We say, Bill, hey, I got something for when the crew comes. Hey, might have to do that. Hey, Jay Wade makes something, man. I got to get him to uh, to, to show y'all. You know, he makes something. Uh, he makes something where you can, uh, what is it? It's like, a, it, it, it's like a wooden cooler, but it's football themed. And this is a little fireplace right here. You know, not the biggest backyard, you know what I mean? But uh, this is this is our casa. This is it. You know what I mean? Uh, wifey had to have that pool right there. Didn't. That's a whole nother conversation. You know what I mean? But, uh, hey, one thing I do like, though, this is all her decorating, too. I got to say that. Just things are, like, tough, man. You know, uh, as far as, I guess, like, things dying and stuff like that. But we're getting ready to get it all together. I'm getting ready, like I say, and close this patio. Uh, get this uh, cabinet made and do some things <clears throat> and uh, outside of that that's it so right now we have 53 we got six minutes and 50 seconds left what do you say Yeah, he makes them. Hey, that's right, right? Hey, yeah, he makes them himself. The gate is dope with the sun. Oh, yeah, that's something, uh, that's something my, my wife he picked up. Like a little sun. You know, it's like a little ornament or whatever. You know, you pick up your little trinkets or whatever while you out. You know, you, you see different things. You know what I mean? Uh, I just want to make this like my true outdoor set. You know what I mean? I, hey, this is California. Uh, like I say, we get 28 days of average of rain. I don't even know, I must still, I've been gone so long, I got short, I mean, pants on. Normally, when I'm here, I don't wear nothing but shorts. But I'll be in shorts, and as soon as it's stream in, I'm going to be back into them. Canadian Mom, you have, okay, you got to head out. Hey, thank you, uh, Canadian Mom. Hey, I got to get your name. I, I got to be able to call you by your first name, make it personal. All right, back here, Boogie, A.B. Hey, yeah, 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 hey, hey, that, that it is, man. Hey, this is the right spot. For two people, it's just me and my wife. You know what I mean? Uh, hey, you, you can't beat it. You know, uh, hey, the backyard was cozy. You guys can't see now. We took them down, but she had like enclosed it with like these outdoor curtains. Had them like this. Brought a TV out here. We out here had that. Uh, look, brought the curtains. Check it out. Look at this right here. Okay, look, the fireplace. We chill right here. We chill on a little patio furniture. Had this burning. Brought the curtains like right here. Hey, look, and the draft was perfect. Pulling the smoke right out. We watched movies all night and just hang out. I'm getting the ambiance. Hey, you know what? We did a couple tag last night and uh, she said something to me about, one of the questions was about being romantic. I mean, well, shit, that, that don't get no more romantic than that. Chilling with your husband out here on this patio. You know what I mean? Had the pool giving off some, uh, some ambient light. You know what I mean? Uh, all right, let's get back over here. This is what it's about. About to get me sidetracked. 
I'm watching that time, y'all. I got four minutes and uh, a few seconds to go. So let's go ahead and just start wrapping this up right now. Let me just do it like this. I would give this away. Hey, it's bad enough. This right here going, 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 going to warm up my pocket. Give away. But I'll give this away. Hey, Ray, I wish you was here, man. Whoever came and got this, they could have it. Hey, but check it out. Let's talk about this one more time. The giveaway. Small, what is this? Master built propane smoker. Hey, it's portable. Brand new. As you can see, brand spank. Give it this away. All you got to do is go to my Facebook, Smoking and Grilling with AB on Facebook. Soon as this is over with, I'm going right to my phone. I'm getting ready to post up the picture. It's going to say giveaway. All you got to do is put in hashtag enter me. After that, at the end of the month, we're going to do a, a, a random comic picker and we'll go. Not for that big one, man. That ain't, I don't know if it's worth it, all right? Let me just look, man. Let me let me look let me look into it, right? Hey, oh, another thing too. Those of you that sent me your address, I got sauce. I'm uh, hey, uh, check this out. I got to get it out. I ain't got no excuses. Come Monday, we back up and running, and we go from there. All right, everybody. I want to say uh, thank you for the birthday wishes. You know, coming to hang out with me. Took a shot with Snoop and the rest of uh everybody in the stream one more i got it i got it all man i wrote them down everybody sent them to me i wrote them all down so i ain't gotta come you know keep looking for them or whatever canadian mom cheers this one's for you thank you thank you for spending some time with me on my birthday you know what I mean? I don't know what I'm gonna do on my 24th, uh, 24th birthday, but I'm uh, I'm gonna get it in some kind of way. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do about this right here, though. This little patch of gray. I was telling uh, KK, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the store and get that jet black. What y'all think about that jet black? Even though this ain't never been jet black. Hey, look, Canadian mom say no. Hey, hey, Ray, you say oh the dark. Hey, what you know about the dark and lovely? I have some of that up in the house. Hey, Gray, hey, this right here is season. I embrace this. This right here, this is who I am. You know what I mean? Proud to be where I'm at today, and I'm good with it. Hey, Gray, say it's too late for you. Hey, they got that other stuff. You brush in gradually. You know what I mean? Salt and pepper. That's right. Hey, this, this adds character. Hey, this is why they call me the big homie. You know what I mean? All right, y'all. Hey, thank you. Uh, man, can't, hey, I don't even really know what to say. But uh, hey, when I say I mean, when I say thank you, that's what I mean. Hey, I'm like blown backwards. Hey, love it. Uh, that's right, experience, season. Hey, told my son that. I was like, hey, you think you smart and you got all the muscles and all that, but I'm gonna take experience every time. All right, y'all, we gonna wrap it up. And uh, outside of that, hey, thank you. Everybody say, you know, hello. Uh, thank you. To, you know, say uh, mingle with everybody. I know I'm late saying that. But I'm getting ready to go ahead and get my day started. Change into a pair of shorts. Put on me a fresh, crispy white. Can't wear no white beater underneath it. It's too hot today. And uh, outside of that, Snoop, Ray Mac, Rob D, Canadian Mom. I know you're going already. Everybody else that was in here. Uh, Ray, Ray Bacon. Let's see. Uh, Meathead chilling and grilling with Rob D. Of course, I'm gonna say your whole name. I like that chilling and grilling. Uh, and everybody else, we got Kirby. Uh, man, I'd have to go back and just like look at that, but I just want to say, hey, thank you for spending some time with me on my birthday. Outside of that, a bizzle is out. Hey, thank you, Canadian mom. Thank you. I need that. Thank you. Hey, and blessed. Uh, I want to say, hey, bless everybody in this stream. All right, everybody. Bye.